Okay, I'm going to talk to you about how to use parenthetical citations right now. Okay, you're writing your clothing company letter and you need to use some evidence. You need to use some direct quotes or paraphrased information to really prove your point to your clothing company. So I want Adidas to see, hey, I know that you're using child labor because it says right here, Children as young as 15 were made to work 15-hour days. They had to work 70 hours a week and do overtime, and they got less than $60 a month. It's a good quote. Okay, so I'm going to take that quote. I'm going to put it in my letter. I'm going to format this to look right. Okay, simple. There's my quote. I'm going to capitalize this. Well, first of all, it needs to go in quotation marks to prove that it's a quote. Now I'm going to put a period at the end. Okay, parenthetical citations are really simple. Okay, they're per parenthetical, so they have to go into parentheses. Okay, and all that goes in the parentheses is the author's last name. Okay, so you go to your article. I'm going to look for the author. There's the author. And Jason Burke is the author. So I just want his last name, Burke. So let's go here, B-U-R-K-E. Simple. That is a parenthetical citation. Let's try another one. Um, let's see, new article. Oh, that's not what I wanted. Okay, so let's go find a different article about um, Adidas using child labor. Oh, this is a good article. Okay, if I wanted to use something from this article, I love this quote down here where they talk about how um, when the inspectors come, we have to tell them we're paid minimum wage. We mustn't tell them we work overtime and on weekends. And uh, we fill up the first aid kit. Okay, so I'm going to just copy that. I could paraphrase it, but it's easy to just use a direct quote. Okay, there it is. There's my direct quote in quotation marks. Okay, let me put on the little um, transition between the last quote. Um, also, in many factories, Employees say that, okay, the first aid box is filled. We're told what to say if the inspector speaks to us. That makes sense. Okay, so I've used this quote. Now I want to tell my reader where I got this quote, this direct quote from. I'm going to go to the article. There's the author right there. I'm just going to use the author's last name, Marks. It's a parenthetical citation. I put it in parentheses. Marks. Okay, if there is a article that doesn't have an author, you'd use the title. So if I'm going to go to, let's say, this website, and I wanted to use this information here, uh, we're forced to work overtime. Otherwise, I can't supply on the meager income. How can I pay my rent? Okay, so that's pretty good. Oh, they worked for 10 years at minimum wage without a pay rate. That's even better. Let's use that one. I like that. Adidas doesn't give raises. 10 years at minimum wage? Mm, let's paraphrase. Um, Many workers say they worked at an Adidas factory for around 10 years and never got a raise. All right, took that information, put it into my own words. Mm -hmm. Now, I need to give credit to the author of this article. There isn't an author, so I'm going to cite it by the title, Labor Behind the Label. 
yeah, labor behind the label. Okay. So um, I'm gonna it's a parenthetical citation. I'm gonna use parentheses. And it's the title of an article, so I'm gonna put the title in quotation marks. Labor behind the label. Now, of course, I'll have a work cited that will have the full citation. And big. And big. Well, the purpose of parenthetical citations is they're allowing the reader to know, um, okay, I have my work cited with three or four, you know, citations on it. This tells the reader, okay, I got this quote right here from this source. And I got this quote from this source. And I got this quote from this source. If you want to see the full citations, you can look in my work cited. But this is just a quick reference to my works cited so you know which quote or which paraphrase information comes from which source. Okay, so in review, oh, there's a typo, please. Is that still dry? Ooh. Um, in review, parenthetical citations are in parentheses. What you put in parentheses is the author's last name. If there is no author, you could use the title of the source. Make sure you capitalize the title and put it in quotation marks. A parenthetical citation is a quick reference to the full source citations, which can be found in your work cited. But what these do is they quickly let the reader know which information comes from which source. So it helps them stay organized. Okay, make sure you use parenthetical citations in your letter. Thank you.